Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. All right, we expect temperatures to continue to fall through the 40s slowly this evening. Still some showers around at 7 o'clock, but between 7 and 9, we'll see the rain start to end from west to east across the Miami Valley. And by 9 o'clock, I think most of the rain will be east of our viewing area. 45 at 9 p.m. and then 45 at 11. Look for cloudy skies. That will help keep temperatures relatively stable for a little while early tonight. But after midnight, the clouds move out. We'll see temperatures dropping off. Mid-30s expected tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock and even the chance of some frost 48 at noon and we'll be up in the mid 50s tomorrow afternoon. Look for partly to mostly sunny skies again. Those showers ending this evening with scattered frost forming late tonight. Lots of sunshine around Friday. More frost is likely Friday night and both nights will have chances for temperatures uh, to drop down around the freezing mark in some locations. A nice fall weather expected Saturday. Late day shower chance comes our way on Sunday. Speaking of that frost likely tonight, tomorrow night again the freeze a uh, possible Saturday morning some places could get down to 32 in some of our western counties even tonight, especially out in eastern Indiana and maybe along the Ohio Indiana border could hit that freezing mark where our frost and freeze warnings are in effect. Frost advisory freeze warning uh, to the west across Indiana and a freeze watch over the southeast part of the state, West Virginia and western Pennsylvania expecting those cold temperatures tomorrow night. Richmond could drop down around the freezing mark uh, in the Whitewater River Valley, generally mid 30s here around Dayton and uh, scattered frost and then low to mid 30s as you go north and then daytime highs tomorrow uh, should be around 54 in Sydney and Urbana, 56 in Troy, 55 Springfield and Greenville and also in the mid 50s here around Dayton, but maybe some mid to upper 50s to the west out toward Richmond and also Oxford. High temperature Saturday right around 60 degrees. Goodwill Auto Auction camera tonight. Uh, you can see the clouds have been moving through this afternoon. Wet roads out there. Rainfall amounts have been on the light side. Jason Thompson in Brookville, a tenth of an inch. Jeff Cador in Bell Center, a couple tenths of an inch. And Joshua Hyday and Bob Hawks both down in Springboro, about uh, two tenths of an inch of rain. And maybe some places get up to close to a quarter of an inch, but most areas will stay around a tenth to two tenths as the rain continues to move through. And right now, some of the slightly heavier showers up around Urbana and Springfield moving east, a few leftover showers in Dayton. And now we're seeing that dry weather push east there along 127. Uh, Greenville, still some sprinkles in your area, but the rain should be tapering off already. Skies clearing out through eastern Illinois, moving into northwest Indiana. That uh, clearing headed our way uh, later tonight. Right now in Dayton, 51, a southwest wind at 9 miles per hour. But you can see the 40s to the west of us, 48 Greenville, 45 at Richmond. Uh, still around 50 here in the southeastern part of our viewing area. There's the rain scooting on through and moving out out after about 7, 8 o'clock. Showers around early tonight, then clearing. Could see some frost, low 36. And tomorrow, lots of sunshine through the day and a high temperature of 55 with that sun up at 749. And your Storm Team 2 seven-day forecast, a 60-degree high on Saturday after morning low of 33 with some scattered frost. And then we're in the low 60s on Sunday, a slight chance of showers, a little better chance of showers Monday and cooler in the 50s. But by Thursday, we could be back up near 70.